I'm Ban Ye-moon, the eighth Secretary General of the United Nations, now Honorary Chairman of the Institute of Global Engagement and Empowerment at the Uni Yonsei University, Republic of Korea. As a Secretary General, I have observed and experienced many conflicts, many uh, disputes come from lack of global vision. I have recently established Ban Ki-moon Center for Global Citizens to not only help promote sustainable development goals, but also foster young people with the global citizenship. That's the basic purpose of this course. The reason why I was inspired to participate in this course was because of the incredible process that created the Sustainable Development Goals, where individuals, companies, and organizations from around the world participated to share their thoughts on the world we want by 2030. This participatory process resulted in the incredible agenda that the Sustainable Development Goals represent and all of these uh, individuals, organizations, companies, and other organizations have a share in achieving the SDGs in the future. Sustainable development means that we must not deal only with short-term perspectives and short-term problems. It is our obligation to look further in the future, to deal with uh, problems of long-time development with problems beyond one period of parliament, of one period of a government, and uh, to do it not only on a national uh, basis, but on a global basis. The university as an institution has a unique role to play in our society. Through integrated in-depth research, open communication with the public, and teaching young students, we can create new ways to meet the needs of the world. My hope is that all actors in higher education will take ownership to resolve the common problems faced by humanity and that universities will become more engaged with the rest of the society. My role as Director of Corporate Responsibility is looking at how our company can maximize its positive impact on society while minimizing any negative impact of doing our business. I hope that people listening to my section of the course will be inspired by some of the stories at Relics Group and how we are approaching co good corporate governance and the Sustainable Development Goals to consider their own actions and how they can make contributions in their companies and in their research to advance these important issues. I am from a small and obscure country, uh, Cameroon uh, in Africa. There was a little hospital in my city that really had some challenges. And through working with a group of other young people at the age of 26, we were able to raise about $60,000 to renovate this hospital. I think that was the turning point because it made me realize how powerful a young person, any young person anywhere in the world could be to transform not only one community, but your country, a continent, and the world at large. People think you need to travel or you need to read books about world history in order to have a global citizenship mentality. That's not what it's about. If you wanna learn about the world, care about the world, then you can start in your own communities. I got involved, I organized a quiz night at my old high school that raised $1,000 to build a school in Papua New Guinea. There are things you can do. You don't have to fly to the other part of the world. There are things you can do in your local community volunteer with the Salvation Army, run a quiz night, or en engage with your local officials. That's what global citizenship is about. It's about active citizenship and it's about empathy. This is relevant for the very existence of human beings. We, we need a world where a minimum of equal chances is existing. We need a world where hunger is abolished we need a world that is not tortured by one war after the other. And if I take this all together, 
it is covered by the sustainable goals, long-term goals, peaceful goals, humane goals, humanistic goals, and goals which need the cooperation of nations and continents and individuals. And that's a great task. And uh, you have a good feeling if you devote energy to these long-time goals.